Is this line not going to move at all? What is going on? This is Narita International Airport, and this is Immigration Officer Sasaruta Roshin. You remember him. Well, today he's feeling a tad nervous, shaken up, if you will. Will you? I'm only staying through tomorrow. Two days is long enough. Competition prep is up to you, Jason. I've got someone to see. Yes, sir! largest muscle groups in your body, the back. I've been looking forward to this. Hey, is it just me or does it feel like we're just skipping right through the plot today? Are we? I can never tell. Match yours, muscle lesson of the day. It's me, Muscle Bro Machio. When you look at your back, you'll notice three different sections. The top portion is your traps, next is the lats, and the lower center is your erector spinae. When you want to work all three at once, the seated row machine is an excellent option. The push and pull movement targets all three muscle groups simultaneously, resulting in a well-balanced workout. This can also be a great warm-up exercise by choosing a lighter weight. Squeeze your shoulder blades together and pull the handle straight toward your navel. Slowly return the handle and feel your blades open up naturally. Avoid letting your body sway in any direction so that you don't waste energy. Keep your core sturdy and your back straight and strong. Use controlled movements for a set of 15 reps. If you're training at home or if the machine's in use at the gym, you can do back extensions on a mat. Lie on your stomach with your palms on either side of your head. Gently lift your shoulders and your legs up off the floor and then come back down slowly. Building strong back muscles helps prevent stiff shoulders, headaches, bad posture, and even osteoporosis. Superset these moves with ab exercises for a complete and balanced workout. Like back extensions, there are other moves you can do at home. Even if you can't make it to the gym, you can still get a good workout. Yeah! He's really good. It's like he knows exactly what to say to make it make sense. I guess that's to be expected since he's been doing it a while. Yeah. I think someone else here told me the reason for that. Mr. Machio is apparently more advanced because he went to school overseas. Really? Where exactly? I heard he went to an American university, so I guess that's where? I think he was studying sports theory or something like that. And freestyle! What? I can't hear you with all the stars and muscles bursting in the background. But I get it. He's gotta have some extensive knowledge if he didn't sell his soul to create a body like that. Right? That means we must be getting some top shelf training. What if he's like record breaking good and we didn't even know? <sighs> Closing time. <sighs> My pecs are having a disturbing reaction to something. Sweat allergies? <gasps> Look, they're moving! Should we call a doctor? They're twerking now! I know this feeling. It usually happens when... Could it be? Looks like your pecs are still getting jiggy with it. <sighs> <sighs> Oh, Why do they look like scared dog? Yeah, because that dude's got a tree trunk for a neck. He is filled with such power. I wonder if his claws will burst like confetti. Just stop, 
Please, this is already weird enough without you invoking the spirit of awkward. So, what brings you here? Isn't it obvious? I came here to see you. <gasps> we Whoa. know him, right? Get out! Is that... I asked you first. It looks like him. No. Wait, hold on. You know this guy? Kind of. He's in the Seven Commandos movies. He's like famous. It's Barnum Schwarzenegger! Schwarzenegger! <laughs> Am I supposed to know who that is? He's an American actor, but more than that, he was like a mascot for action films in his day and I've seen almost all of them. He had a killer beast body and did some clutch A action movies, but he played good guys most of the time. America was obsessed with him first and then the rest of us got on. He's the star of some of the best action movies ever! That jaw! You don't have that jaw unless you're Arnold Schwarzenegger! Still oh, have no, no idea, idea who that is. is. Wow, such beautiful muscles! Seriously? What's wrong with you? Have you never seen the last action predator? What about Conan the Red Bull? Or Twin Cops, maybe? Is this a prank? So you're saying he's a famous movie star, but only in America? Why would he be in Japan? No time for movies, only chess and ice skating. Okay, it's coming back. I think I have seen one of his films. See, I knew you'd remember. It was the one where you play a robot from the future, and you fight and destroy things to rescue a boy. And then you leave and say, I'll be by. <laughs> Sorry, no. You might be thinking of a friend of mine. That's so awkward. Get that back right now. Just you 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 I'm so freaking sorry. So, uh, were you and Barnold friends in school? How do you know each other? Right after high school, I went to college in America. I was studying sports theory there. That's when I was first introduced to bodybuilding. Eventually, Mr. Schwarzenegger here became my personal coach and weight training mentor. Conan the villain was your mentor? Why are you visiting me now? You never called me once to say hello or ask how I was doing after I graduated. Did you even care that I went back to Japan? I am sorry you are hurting Naruto, but believe me, there was a reason for my absence. What reason could that be? I stored all your information in my smartphone. And I dropped that phone into a pool! No! Oh, then you were the stupid one, da. Oh, that sucks. Poor Barney. But he didn't mean to ghost you. Why didn't you try to contact Barney after you hadn't heard from him? Yeah, good question. I was taking a mirror selfie like you do, and I accidentally crushed my phone. Wow. I can relate, surprising. man. No worries at all. Such a great but can you, though? How common is it to accidentally destroy your phone while taking flex shots? I only recently figured out how to find you. I came across your photo while checking out gyms with multiple branches. And you came all the way out here just to see me? I'm honored, sir. No problemo. It's not a coincidence that we've been reunited. Huh? I believe this was the work of the muscle gods. <laughs> it couldn't be. Wait, I want to know more about the muscle gods. Should I ask? Probably be rude to interrupt. Show me how you did it, Naruto. After graduation, what was your plan? I want to know all the ways you managed to master the art of the muscles. <laughs> Is that a freaking hand grip? Does this look familiar? Today we're going to show you how to use hand grips in your workout. Lots of men like to use them to increase the size of their forearms. But as most women know, this tool helps to strengthen your grip, which comes in handy for many reasons. You can buy hand grips at most sporting goods stores or home improvement warehouses in the tool section. The amount of resistance varies, so if you're squeezing on a level 1, that's not going to give you much of a workout. Unless you're like a toddler. Of course, if the weight is too strong and you can't even close it once, there is no point. Also, the average grip strength for 20-something men is... 46, and that is in kilograms. The average for women is 28 kilograms. Don't be a show-off. Start with a weight that you can close for a set of 10 to 15 reps. A manageable weight is a must when you're trying to use up any excess energy. Using a grip is not hard. You squeeze it, and then you let it go. Do it slowly or else that's cheating. And that's the workout. Try to do three sets of 15 to 20 repetitions. If you want a more challenging variation of this exercise, choose a grip that you can only close by using both hands. Once it's closed, hold it in one hand and open the grip slowly. 
The muscles are targeted by keeping the movement controlled. Most people know that grips help to train your forearm muscles and that stronger forearms mean a stronger grip. If your grip is tight and controlled, you can increase your overall training performance in the gym. But did you know that using a hand grip regularly also has benefits for your everyday life? Many of which will surprise you. It feels so good to watch your strength come through right when you need it the most. Treat that hand grip like the squeezy miracle it is. Your grip will soon be strong as ox. The gripper you're holding has the third strongest resistance in the world. Only about a hundred people on the planet have been able to close it using one hand. This is the perfect opportunity for us to see your true strength. It's up to you to decide now! You're gonna crush it or not! Yes, sir. Look at the gripper! He really did crush it! Congratulations! You've met all the requirements! I'm sponsoring a bodybuilding competition here in Japan. It's off tomorrow! Powerhouse men from all around the world will compete, break records, and shape history! Isn't that kind of short notice? I want you to compete as well, Narazo. The time has finally come! The world must be made aware of your shiny muscle power! Mr. Machio might be a world champion. He's got no time to prepare. I get that there's a huge win up for grabs and that this is a big deal. I still have to wonder. What does this have to do with a hand gripper? This one's only available today. Free samples, come and get it. I'm so bad. <laughs> <laughs> So fired up! <laughs> cool! There are lifters from everywhere! <sighs> are you okay, Akami? What's up? I've got this peaceful feeling for some reason like I've just come home. Uh, I mean, your house is in this neighborhood, so... Looks like they're divided into classes according to height. Zeke's on stage now. It says Mr. Machio is at the very end of the bodybuilders group. Let's go find seats so we can start cheering for him. I think the second floor is already full now. It's almost like we should have come here earlier. There they are. The little geisha girls. Uh, Barney! Barney, Barney! I miss you so much! <laughs> <laughs> Hasta la vista, baby! Me? I don't know what that means, but everybody's perfect! They say a good comedy requires a good street, man. I guess that's us. Eight days a week! Are you ready? I've got VIP seats for you girls. Awesome! Thank you! It's just like the movies where you look all angsty, but you're super sweet! What? How is that humanly possible? I hope that was rhetorical! The bodybuilding preliminaries are about to begin. Everyone, please take your seats. There they are! They're exactly as buff as I'd hoped they'd be! Guys, I've never seen a bodybuilding show before. Do you know how they decide who the winner is? I thought physique and bodybuilding competitions were one and the same. I'll explain everything. I know it's a lot to take in so last minute, but I've got you little Japanese Russian geisha girls. I could be wrong, but I have a feeling he's misusing that word. He is, but at least he knows we're not in China. Physique and bodybuilding competitions have very different judging criteria. A physique contestant builds a slender V-shaped body and gains points on face, hair and wardrobe choice and design. One major difference is that the lower body is hardly ever judged in a physique show. Bodybuilders score points for specific poses for the whole body at every competition. Go ahead and look close at the stage. This is called the relaxed pose. From there, they'll do the mandatory poses. We've 
got front double biceps. That's a front lat spread. This is the side chest. Pack double biceps. Here's a back lat spread. Tricep pose. And abdominal and thigh pose. Those are the standard poses. In addition to these, some organizations will also include the most muscular pose. Mr. Machio does these poses all the time. That's it? I thought there were going to be music and more poses. Like he said, these are just the standard ones. You're thinking of the final rounds. Each finalist performs a freestyle routine of their most impressive poses in time with the musical piece of their choice. You get to learn a little about their personalities. After the freestyle comes the pose down. This is the final round. The finalists will all be asked to do the same pose and be compared until a winner is decided. Front double biceps. Okay, and relax. Front lat spread. Shred it hard, guys! You're huge! Look at those arms! Don't forget to smile! My daddy's so cool! Go number 11! Go 15! Show me those pecs, 18! That crowd! Oh my gosh! That old dude loves some pecs. The pose down is the most exciting part of the competition for most viewers. Wow! I get it! <laughs> oh, watch this! It's the 180 plus class! Man, those are gigantor! Hang on! Why are those guys at the front? There are a lot of contestants in this class. They've been divided into groups so that they can all be seen and judged equally. Those abs are grenades! I'm gonna hike up those biceps! Balance for shoulders! They all look amazing! My real life works of art! I guess I didn't expect there to be this many men in the audience. But like, how do you decide whose huge muscles are better? Hmm, I can see how it's hard to tell. It's not just about the muscle size. They look at overall muscle balance, how well the body oil is applied, and of course, how beautiful the poses are. That's the basic recipe for bodybuilding victory! Yeah! Cool! So there's more to it than just building muscle! Look! There is Mr. Machio! Will the next group please step forward for viewing? Huh? Oh, uh, hi! It's getting real! Every person in that audience would later say that they felt the presence of an actual god! Oh! And now that makes total sense! This is what you've been up to over the years. Hmm. No more muscle. No more muscle. No more muscle. Are they scared? Look at the contestants. They're kneeling down before Mr. Machio. That must mean he won. I can't imagine what that last scene looked like for someone watching out of context. Congrats on your victory, Naruto. To think you defeated so many veterans last minute without ever breaking a sweat. The young samurai I knew really has grown up. Thanks, that means a lot to me. I had a really great time today. Those guys were the best of the best. Although, I'm only measuring that on a very small ruler. You didn't think I would notice that none of the international champs I know were on that stage tonight? <laughs> That means the competition itself was yet another test. Tell me I'm wrong. You're right! Congratulations, you passed your second test! Why do you think I've been training so many students up until this point? I wanted to create a bodybuilder who was capable of competing with me as an equal! Our final showdown will be nowhere else but Las Vegas! I'll be ready for you! Not a no! Uh, sorry, I can't. I've got to work so I can't just fly to America. I've got clients who depend on me as their trainer. Oh, never mind then. Work ethic, kids. That's how you grow big and strong. You did it! Congrats, Mr. Machio! 
Thank you very muscle. Hey, Machio, huh? what do you say we hustle some muscle today? Let's, Let's hustle, hustle some, some muscle. muscle. What the? Who's that guy with him? I haven't properly introduced myself yet. I work as Sir Shortsenator's private secretary. My full name is Jason Scatham. Dude, you're in your underwear. You don't have to be so formal. Actually, I didn't know that about you, man. I stayed in Japan under his direct order, and one of my major assignments was to support young Naruzo's training program with my assistance. <laughs> Please don't worry about me. I'm content to blend in with the rest of the extras when I'm not needed. <laughs> oh, so you're not even gonna make an effort? Naruzo and friends, listen up. Get out there and hustle those muscles. Yes, Quit sir. trying to make hustle muscle happen. It sucks. We'll hustle you're gonna muscle. be an extra. You can't uh. talk. <laughs> and just like that, the gym got a strange new member. Hello, muscle. You are more Today we've been working on our backs, so let's start with back extensions. Lie on your stomach and bend your body upwards. Squeeze your rear to support your spine as you raise and lower your arms and legs. When you come up, only aim to get your chest off the ground. Pushing too hard can cause injury. This exercise is great when you do it right. You'll work out your thighs and glutes with your back. When you lift up, Hold for a few seconds before coming back down. Your goal is 10 reps. If you're ready, let's do it. Here's one. And two. Inhale and up and three. exhale coming down. There's four. Make sure you're not holding your five. breath. Now six. This and is a great seven. rhythm. Don't change the pace. Here's eight. Stay controlled so one you don't lose more. your balance. Ten. Done! Nice work! That was great! Your spine will thank you! Remember to include this exercise as part of your back day workout. And just like last week, true strength comes from within!